The vertical cursor gadget is a tool for analyzing data that contain features which are coordinated in the X dimension. One common application is examining simultaneous time series output of several sensors. To open the tool, make a graph window active and select Gadgets Vertical Cursor. A cursor is placed on the graph and an accompanying display dialog is placed in the Origin workspace as well. The cursor itself is movable and bisects all vertically stacked layers in a given graph. Notice that the points of intersection of the cursor and the data are displayed beside the cursor in each of the layers. These values update automatically as the cursor is moved. You may additionally increase or decrease the font size of the label until you can see it comfortably. You may additionally hide the label altogether by clicking on the appropriate buttons in the vertical cursor accompanying dialog. By default, the gadget displays only the Y value of the points of intersection. You can change this by going to the Options dialog for the vertical cursor and on the Labels and Tags tab, selecting X and Y if you'd like to see both, or selecting some custom format and using LabTalk script convention to assign that format. I'm going to leave it at the XY coordinates for now and select OK. Once the cursor is in a desired position, the points of intersection of the cursor and the data can be tagged on the graph by pressing the Tag button. A tag leaves the values in the position they were even after the cursor is moved. Additionally, the points of intersection may be output to a worksheet by selecting this button in the vertical cursor dialog. Let's pick a couple more points, generate more output, and now select the adjacent button to go to the worksheet and see the output. And now you see the points in the worksheet together with the points in the graph and the original data. This concludes this tutorial. Thank you for watching.